Now here's a mistake almost every new Python programmer makes at some point. Let's say you want to create a list of positive numbers from 1 to 10. So to do this, we can use the range function and pass the range from 1 to 11 and then convert it into a list using the list function. Now as we run the program, we get the list of positive numbers from 1 to 10. But now let's say we want to create a list of negative numbers in the same range. At first, you might think to use the range from 1 to negative 11. However, when we run this code, we get an empty list. Strange, right? So what went wrong here? The problem lies in how the range function works. In Python, whenever the start value is greater than the stop value, the result is an empty list, unless a step value is provided to reverse the direction of the range. In our example, the range function is trying to increment from positive 1 to negative 11, which doesn't satisfy the condition, and that's why we get an empty list. To fix this issue, we just need to provide a step value of negative 1, which tells Python to decrement the range instead of incrementing. So now as we run the program, you can see that we're getting the list of numbers from 1 down to negative 10.